Let's get to our next guest because he knows a whole lot about small caps. He's Eric Cinnamon, Portfolio Manager at Intrepid Capital. He manages the Intrepid Small Cap Fund, which soared more than 40 percent this year. And Eric uh, joins us from uh, Jacksonville, Florida. And Eric, uh, I mean, hearing from, from what Sheila is saying, uh, does it look like we're set for a pretty big rally in small caps in 2010 or not? Well, you, you know, small caps going into 2009 were very attractively priced. And going into 2010, just from a bottom-up valuation basis on the companies we're doing research on, they're not uh, nearly as attractive. So I would just be, you know, have a little you know, prudence in that, uh, yes, there are still some small caps attractively priced, but from a valuation perspective, they're nowhere near as attractive as they were heading into 2009. In uh, another thing that was mentioned, and I think it's accurate, is a lot of the cyclical names have done extremely well, especially in small caps. And the Morgan Stanley cyclical index is up, I think, 80 percent about uh, for the year. So a lot of these small caps, especially the cyclical small caps, have already priced in a pretty strong recovery. In fact, that index is above now where it was in September of 08. But everything's had a big rally. So Russell versus, say, the S&P, which gives you a, a flavor of big and small, and the Dow. I mean, where do you think the outperformance will lie next year? You know, we, we don't do a lot of top-down work or predicting where the market's headed. But, you know, again, all I can say is from a bottom-up perspective on the companies we're working on, they're already priced fairly, especially in small caps. So gains from here will require some form of speculation. And, of course, you know, we know what happened uh, last time we speculated in small caps, and that was around 2007, early 2008, when right. prices deviated from the true value of those companies. You had LBO firms coming in, paying outrageous uh, valuations for these companies, and a lot of people were hurt. So I don't think we really want strong gains from here. I mean, it would be nice, but I don't know if it would be responsible. Okay, then, Eric. Uh, but, you know, but your job, of course, is to find uh, what are the great values in the small cap space. So what are you gravitating towards? Well, we talked about the cyclicals already pricing in a recovery, and we're really avoiding a lot of the names that we think have priced in a strong recovery in 2010. So we're focusing more on stable companies, companies that generate a lot of cash, have strong balance sheets, and that we can value with a high degree of confidence. Um, one of those names is uh, C CSG Systems. They're the market leader in billing services for the uh, cable and satellite companies. They have 90% of their revenues locked in with long-term contracts. Their next contract doesn't expire to 2012. Mm. It generates about $1.90 a share in free cash flow. So on a $19 stock, it's about a 10% free cash flow yield. And they have as much cash as debt. So it's a really the type of company we look for, high visibility, strong free cash flow, and a good balance sheet. Right, the balance sheet being a key issue. Okay, Eric, we're, uh, we have to leave it there. But thanks so much for joining us. Eric Cinnamon at Intrepid Capital.